I'm going to introduce you guys to the baby sloth that was born just a couple weeks ago. We're going to just take them and head on to the sloth room. Is that good? Oh, I think, I think Suki's really enjoying the carrot. Oh my goodness. Look how itty bitty that baby is. What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are having an amazing day so far. So I'm here with Theo, my capuchin monkey, and he's going to be our assistant for the day and just helping us out, guiding us through today's video. Isn't that, isn't that right, buddy? Are you going to be helping us? Isn't that right? Yeah, that's right. So in today's video, we are shortly going to be heading down to my brother's house, making all three sloths their afternoon feeding. And guys, special surprise here. I don't know if you've seen it on my brother's channel, but I'm going to introduce you guys to the baby sloth that was born just a couple weeks ago. Now, this baby sloth is absolutely adorable. It is so tiny. Now, we're not sure if it's a girl or boy yet because we can't really, you know, take it off the mom yet. It's still clinging onto the mom. But guys, this, this little baby is to die for. I mean, I'm in love with it, and I think you guys are going to be in love with it, too. So we have just arrived to my brother's house, and I haven't even gotten out of the car, and of course we have to get greeted by big old Zeus and Xena. Hi, bubbies. Hi, bubbies. Oh, my goodness. Oh, you like the chin scratches? Yeah, close your eyes. Hi, Mama. I see you, too. Come over here to get scratched. Are you pawing your, your boyfriend? Come here, Mama. Now before we head to go see the sloths and make them their afternoon feeding bowls, we're gonna let Theo see his best friend and I'm pretty stoked to see how he reacts with her because he hasn't seen her in quite some time. I know I know he's pretty excited, so what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna flip the camera around. Go on ahead, open this up. And there she is! Oh my goodness, Theo! Okay, so we're gonna try and head inside without her her getting in my way because she likes to give love and she likes to get under your feet. So we're gonna sit down right here. All right, guys. Okay. So here are the two babies. Look, Theo, it's your best friend. Oh my goodness. Hi, mamas. I haven't seen you in so long. Theo, it's your best friend. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's a, it's a little monkey attack. You can just see that these two babies absolutely love each other. I mean, there are literally two peas in a pod, right, Theo? Look, it's your friend. It's your friend, baby, Theo. Oh my goodness, you guys love each other. Yeah, you're looking at her paw? All right, guys, so we're in the efficiency where we keep all of the food for the animals. You can see Theo is gonna be my assistant today and he's gonna help us chop and make the sloth bowls right here. So if you come on and look over here, we have our lettuce, we got our carrots, we got our squash, zucchini, and we got our sweet potato and we are going to make these bowls. So the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna take this lettuce right here, we're gonna cut off the ends. We're gonna go ahead and put that to the side and just basically we're just gonna split this up. So we're gonna put a piece right there. We're actually gonna take that, okay, one piece in there. All right, so now that we have that split, it is now time to cut the carrots. So if you look on over here, we must cut the ends off. Okay, now we're gonna flip this around. Now these are great vitamins for these guys right here. Now you can see they get a lot of fruits and veggies throughout the day. Now we're just gonna cut this in half so these guys can pick them up and cut them one more time in half. So we're gonna throw that in like that. Okay, throw that in. Cut this piece right here. So now that we got our carrots and lettuce, we're gonna go on ahead, put the carrots off to the side and now we're on to the squash right here. So we're gonna cut the ends off like so. Okay, now we're gonna go on ahead, cut this in half, and cut it like this. We're gonna put one, two, three, and then we're gonna do the same to the other bowl. So we're gonna give one, and then two, three, like that. Now that we got the squash in, the next thing we have is our zucchini right here. So we're gonna cut the ends off. Okay, now we're gonna cut it in half. And now cutting it in half gives the sloth a better grip because if you notice, their claws are kind of like hooks. So what they do is they honestly grab it up like this and will feed themselves holding the vegetables like this and pretty much have a good grip on it. So that's why we want to cut it in long strips like this. We're going to go ahead and put that one in. Okay, two and three. And then we're going to go and one, two, and three, like so. So guys, we got our bowls nice and ready. Now the last thing we need to add, or the second to last thing we need to add is the sweet potato. So we're gonna go on ahead, open this up, 
and just add three each. Okay, Theo, you, you can't eat that. Come on, buddy. Come on. So we're going to add three like so. Put three. Okay, since we got three, now before we add their biscuits, we are going to add some probiotic right here. So this is fast track. And all we're going to do is we're going to pop the lid off, and we don't want to give them too much because they don't really like the taste of it. Theo, buddy, this is, this is not yours. You can't have that. That's not good for you. So we're going to go on ahead, and we only want to sprinkle a little because these guys don't really like the taste of this. So we're going to go on ahead and make sure we get the squash right here, and just sprinkle, 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 okay, like sprinkle it like so, okay. Now we're going to go to the next bowl like this, make sure we get the vegetables. You can see it's going on. It's not too much, but it's just enough to be a perfect amount. Now that we got that sprinkled, we are going to add the biscuits. Now the last thing we must add to complete these bowls are leaf eater biscuits right here. Now the leaf eater biscuits are essential nutrients. They actually provide tons of fiber and protein for daily life for these guys. So we're just going to go on ahead and add three biscuits to one bowl and then three biscuits to another. And believe it or not, this is also a monkey biscuit. So Theo, you, you want a biscuit? You want that buddy? Are you gonna, are you gonna munch on that? Here, you gotta eat it. Look, you gotta lick it. Does it taste good? Guys, I think, I think Theo likes it. You can see Theo is enjoying it. He is just rubbing it on his head and licking all of the dust that's on his fingers from it. Is that, is that tasty? You like that biscuit, buddy? All right, guys, now that we have completely finished making the sloth bowls right here, we're gonna just take them and head on to the sloth room. So we are about to head into the first sloth room with a bean and sushi in three, two, and... All right, guys, let's head in. So lock your head, and oh my goodness, guys. Do you see that? Bean and Suki are out. They know what's up. They know we have their food and they are already reaching because these guys are starving. So we're gonna go ahead, put their bowls right here and we're actually gonna hand feed these little guys right here. So we're gonna feed Bean right here, which is the female. You want that girl? Oh, that's so yummy. Look, Theo, you can't touch it. You can't, that, that's gonna hurt you. That's sharp. So now we're gonna grab another carrot for Bean right here. All right, there you go, boy. Oh, that's so tasty. Now, guys, if you notice right here, you can see how they're utilizing their claws right there, holding the vegetables and just munching on them just like so. I mean, look at them. It's absolutely amazing. Now, guys, if you look at their teeth, I don't know if you can see, but they're pretty yellow and they're very, very dirty. And that is because these guys have no enamel on their teeth. So if you get a bite from these guys, it's going to be nasty. You're going to get a terrible infection because it is covered in bacteria right there. Now, if you notice also that they have two toes on the front and three toes on the back. Now, that is a two-toed sloth. Now, three-toed sloth will have three in the front and three in the back. And now, look look how amazing. They are just, they're just chomping it down. They, they're just flying through this carrot. Is that, is that good? Oh, I think, I think Suki's really enjoying the carrot. So now that they're munching on the carrots, we're gonna let them do their thing. They'll eventually, once they're done with their carrots, make their way to their bowls, but we're gonna see if Theo wants to meet the sloth for the very first time and maybe give them a pet. All right, Theo, you wanna pet him? Look, you have to be very gentle. Oh my goodness. What is that? Yeah, put your hand up, look. Oh my gosh. It's so soft. Are those your new friends? What the heck are they? Here, you touch him? Yeah. Yeah, pet it. Yeah, you like his fur? Yeah, is that nice? All right, guys, so we're going to let them do their thing, and we're going to head to the second sloth room. A few moments later. So we're about to head into the second sloth room right here, and now this is actually where the baby and the mom are, and we have two treats for them. They've already been fed this morning because the mom needs to get her vitamins and her proteins, so she needs to be fed really early. And Theo, that's that's not yours, buddy. You can't have that. We gotta feed the baby sloth. All right, guys. So we're gonna head in in three, two, and let's go. All right. So let's see where they are. Oh my goodness, hello. So guys, if you look right here, the mom is in the corner. She kind of feels it's probably safe in the corner, you know, having her baby right here. Now, if we if we just lure her out like so. Come on, mom. Let's see if we can get you out. We want to see your baby. You want that? Are you not in the mood for zucchini today? So we are getting mom to come out and we are feeding her apple right here. Now, guys, if you take a look. Oh my goodness. Look how itty bitty that baby is. That baby is really, really tiny. So we're gonna try and see if we're gonna be able to hand feed this little guy right here. So we got a little piece of zucchini right here. Now we're gonna just go on ahead and nudge a little baby, little guy. Look, you want some? Oh my goodness, guys, look at it. 
Look at him go. He is eating his zucchini. Look at that. He has it in his mouth and he is just munching right now. Let's kind of give him a hand because we're going to try to have to break this up a little bit tinier so he can so he can actually eat it. Here you go, little buddy. Here you go. Come here. Look. Look at him go, guys. Oh my goodness. Look at that little tiny face, that tiny body, and mom is doing a really, really good job nursing this baby because she is keeping this baby so nice and healthy. Look at him. You want another little piece, buddy? Oh my goodness. Just look at that face, guys. Look how precious, and this little guy dropped it, but just look at his little tongue, his little eyes, and little nose. He is just absolutely adorable. I mean, look at that little body. He is just holding on to his mom, and let's see if we can see his little claws right here. Let me see. Let me see, little buddy. Can I see your little fingers? No? Okay, we're not going to disturb you too much. What are you doing, mom? You want another piece? Here, here, have some sweet potato. You want that? Uh, that's not that's not the good stuff, right? That's not the good stuff. We're gonna come on this side. And let's see. Look how tiny this little guy is. Oh my goodness. You're doing such a good job, mama. Alright guys, so we fed all the sloths. You guys got to meet the mom and the baby. You can see she's in the corner now and she she just wants to be left alone. She's snuggling her baby right there. I think I think you can see its little hand right there. I'm not sure, but she is doing an amazing job. So props to this mama right there. But guys, that is going to end today's video. If you all enjoyed today's video, meeting this little tiny guy for the very first time, I'll give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below a name for this little sloth. And guys, if I like your name, I may shout you out in the next video. And if you want to see the little baby grow up and how he does, well, what are you waiting for? Subscribe to my channel in the link down below.